I think we have a problem with how we think of ourselves. Europe used to be a superpower and it might once have possibly become a regulatory superpower, but today it is not. In 2018, Europe, we told the world that we were serious about digital regulation and we introduced the General Data Protection Regulation. And what followed was amazing. More than half of the global GDP, more than half of the world by population by a long way, introduced GDPR like law because they thought that we were serious. Unfortunately, we were not. And strangely enough, this commission in Brussels has completely neglected the legacy of the last commission. They are fixated on the next generation of digital law, on the Digital Markets Act, the Digital Services Act, and many others. And what is very, very peculiar is that actually it could have fixed the markets. It could have dealt with an awful lot of disinformation and other harms if it had simply enforced the GDPR. So we have a situation today where we already have the tools to be the world's regulatory superpower, and they are written and enshrined in the GDPR, which has been there to be enforced since 2018. And we're seeing many member states, Ireland first among them, that are urgently in need of sanction from the European Commission. And that has not happened. Until this commission starts sanctioning member states that have not actually implemented properly the European law in the digital domain that already exists, there is no point in introducing a DMA, a DSA, an AI Act, a DGA. These things are irrelevant and Europe's role in the world, unfortunately, will diminish because if there's one thing we could have offered, it was regulatory leadership. But we're now eating away at our credibility in that area. The GDPR enables every citizen, in fact, every person, even if they're not a citizen, to take power back and it rebalances the relationship we have with big tech. It establishes in law supervisory authorities across the union that have massive power. Our GDPR enforcers have the power by law to obtain access to any premises. They can obtain access to any file. They can investigate with incredible powers and they can also sanction. People, I think, have been distracted by the scale of the fines that are possible. But what they've forgotten is that the ultimate power, what industry is most afraid about, is that the supervisory authorities created by the GDPR have the power to go into the biggest companies in the world and not only to obtain access to any information that they deem necessary, but also to compel those companies to change how they're doing business with our data. That's the ultimate power and it is lying there largely unused. Ein Angebot der Konrad Adenauer Stiftung.